Hello and welcome viewers and subscribers of AVG News. Uh, as you already know, my name is Mkolisi, the son of Nyumbe. I am making this brief video to respond to some worrying concerns by members of the Zimbabwean community who are using the Zimbabwe exemption permit and are working especially at private schools around Houghton. So what we have been told is that there are some schools, private schools in Houghton, which are forcing their members of staff to apply for permits or waivers at the school uh, using somebody who has been given a tender by the schools uh, and they are being forced to use their unbudgeted uh, money to then pay for the required permit or visa. Uh, now the concern that we are getting is that many of these people had not budgeted to apply for the visa or permit any time before the Christmas holidays because many of them travel back home to Zimbabwe and others are traveling to other countries for the Christmas holidays. But now, because they've been forced to apply at the school by people who have supposedly or understandably been given tenders by school authorities who happen also, some of them, to be members of staff at the particular school, they've been given tenders and they're processing applications. Now these teachers now have to be forced or are being forced to pay the 1,700 and something for the permit or 1,500 and something for the waiver from the money that they budgeted for the holidays. So they are asking if this is uh, something uh, which is legal or is something that is necessary. And our response is that nobody can be forced to apply because there are people who don't want even to apply. There are people who have not, as I have said, prepared themselves or budgeted to apply before at the holidays so they want to first check if uh there is any movement after the holidays and then so that they can decide if it's necessary for them to apply or it's not depending on the responses that those have, who have applied are getting so they are not prepared to use any money to apply at this particular time but the schools are telling them that they cannot release uh, their profiles to applicants so they cannot release their profiles to just anybody so they are forcing students i mean they're forcing teachers and students as well uh, of course to apply using this person who they've been given uh, a tender by the school to process applications and we are told that in some schools they are being forced to pay 1000 runs and above for the application process uh, to be done and then 1700 for a permit or 1550 for a visa which makes it 2500 to almost 3000 for a person to apply at the particular school just because the school doesn't want to release um, its profile to just anybody but we understand that of course there is need to keep the profile but this is something for any school which is registered a profile has to be something that is public so why would you keep something that is public to the point of forcing people to then apply at a time when they have not budgeted for that when they have not prepared to, to make the application or when they haven't even decided on whether or not they are going to apply even if uh, there is a need to keep the profile of the school uh, intact or to keep it private this can still be done next year you don't have to force people to pay at a time when they are not ready and then just because you also want to 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 make your business i mean your uh, your holidays boom and then you want to rob certain people of their hard end cash just because they work for you this is some form of exploitation which cannot be allowed it is illegal if you are facing that kind of uh, a force matter of that kind or that kind of exploitation please get in touch with us under the comment section uh, under this uh, video and will give us the name of the school and uh, the contact details so that we can then reach out to them to find out why exactly are they doing this and do they know that this is an illegal act uh, that they are doing so until then you can even whatsapp us or inbox us uh, or, or, on, on email and we will take that but until then please don't forget to subscribe to this channel like this video and share it